Hello boxing fans, let's talk about the champion who destroyed the challenger inside the ring. On March 24, 2001, the WBO World Heavyweight Champion and hard hitter Vladimir Klitschko with 35 wins, 32 knockouts, and only one loss from Ukraine, faced the challenger Derek Jefferson with 23 wins, 19 knockouts, and two losses from the USA. Klitschko got the WBO belt after he won against Chris Bird via unanimous decision last five months ago. The champion Klitschko will make his first title defense against the challenger Jefferson. In the first round, the champion landed huge punches at the challenger. With 34 seconds left, the champion landed two huge left hooks to drop the challenger onto the canvas for the first time in the fight. The challenger was able to make his feet and finish the round. He says, Let's fight. 15 seconds left in the round. Jefferson trying to hold on, bringing the fight forward to Klitschko. Vladimir Klitschko making a huge statement in the first round. In the second round, the champion continued to land huge punches. The left hook to the chin of Derek Jefferson. In 1 minute and 27 seconds, the champion landed a huge straight hand to drop the challenger onto the canvas for the second time in the fight. The challenger was still able to make his feet. However, the champion aggressively attacked the challenger to drop him for the third time in the fight. The challenger was still able to make his feet but unsteady legs. Referee Gennaro Rodriguez have seen enough and waved the fight off, declaring Klitschko a winner via technical knockout in round two. The champion destroyed the challenger in two minutes and nine seconds in round two, with three knockdowns to retain the WBO World Heavyweight belt.